Welcome to Quartus Prime Installer Video Guide. In this video, we will have a look on how to do Quartus installation using the installer in GUI mode. Quartus Prime Installer allows users to download selected components and install it. It is available for Quartus Prime Pro Standard and Lite. To get the installer, search for FPGA Software Download Center or visit the following link. Next, Select your desired version. In the download page, select Installer tab. And to download the executable, click on the .exe for Windows and .run for Linux. In this quick start demo, I will show you how to download and install Quartus along with Agilex 5 device support. First, test your connection if it requires any troubleshooting or proxy setup. Select your components. Here, I will select Quartus and Agilex 5 device support. And as a note, Agilex common file will automatically select it when Agilex 5 or 7 is selected. Next, enable auto install and after install actions. In the after install action, there's a new option called delete downloaded files after install. This allows the installer to automatically delete the downloaded components after the installation process and save more storage space. You may enable or disable this option depending if you want to keep the downloaded file for installations to another computer. Read the license agreement and click here to agree. Finally, click download and install. Here, our install is about to complete and the component will install automatically. After installation, you may have decided to use a different component or device. In this case, you can use the same installer to update your existing installation. To update your current Quartus installation, use the same installer version of your Quartus installer. Here, the green tick shows the current installed components in my Quartus installation. Now, I will add Questa Starter Edition and Cyclone 10 GX. Repeat the same step as previously, and finally, click Download and Install. Let's wait for the installer to download and install two new components to our quarters. For example, you may no longer need certain components in your installation and would like to have some storage space. You can uninstall components from your installation using the same installer. Using the same installer, we can uninstall our install component. For example, I will uninstall Cyclone 10GX device support. Click on it and click on the X button. Next, choose individual components and choose Intel Cyclone 10GX and click on Next. Click OK. Using the installer, as long as you did not delete the downloaded components, you can install the same Quartus version to another computer without the need to connect to internet on the second computer. If you have downloaded components from one computer, you can use the component and the installer to install Quartus to another computer. You are required to transfer the installer and the downloaded files to another computer. In the other computer, you do not need to re-download the components and you will be able to install it without the need to connect to internet. Let's have a look at a quick demo. In computer one, there are two ways you can go about it. Following the previous installation guide, select your components. Toggle auto install after download. Next, after install actions, but disable delete downloaded files after install. By disabling this, when Computer 1 completes installations, all the download files that is in the directory will not be deleted. Next, view license agreement and click here to agree. And click download and install. After completing the installations, your downloaded file will not be deleted and you can transfer the installer and the components to Computer 2. If you are not required to install in Computer 1 but would like to download components and install in Computer 2, you can use this method. First, select your components 
and click on download. Once the download complete, you can transfer the download files in this directory along with the installer to computer 2. Let's wait for the download to complete. In computer 2, I have transferred the following files from computer 1 after the download and installation complete. Here, I have the downloaded files and the installer. Let's launch the installer. In the installer, click here and change the directory to the folder that contains your components. Next, select your components. Select the components that you have downloaded in computer 1. For example, if I select this component, and it shows 0%, that means that component is not downloaded in computer 1 and I have to download it in my computer 2. Right now, it's doing file integrity check that I, to the files that I have downloaded in computer 1. While waiting, let's toggle auto install after download. Click on after install actions and depending if I would like to keep the downloaded files in my computer and install it in another computer, I can disable this. If not, I can toggle this. Next, view license agreement and click here to agree. And click download and install. For this, I will not be downloading the, the components again, but it will proceed to installations. If you would like to get more information on installing Quartus using command line mode, or you have previously installed Agilex 5 device support, and would like to fetch and active the no-cost license for Agilex 5 E-Series, please search and view the following videos. Thank you for watching.